we're the team behind Tico. As inventors, we constantly use 3D printers to create and test our ideas. But every 3D printer we used fell short of our expectations. They were heavy, overcomplicated, and unreliable. We often spent more time calibrating our printers than printing our inventions. So we came up with a simple solution, Unibody. This is Tico, the Unibody 3D printer. Most 3D printer frames are built using separate rails. Unibody means the rails are built into the chassis, creating one solid piece. One solid piece, Unibody. And with this simple shift in design, all the problems that came from separate rail systems disappeared. More reliable and accurate, Tico sets a new standard for 3D printers. And it doesn't stop at Unibody. Tico has an internal filament tray, an enclosed build chamber, auto safety shutoff, a large print volume, a flexible base, wireless connectivity, and cloud-based software so you can print from almost anywhere on any internet-friendly device. With Tico, we've not only set a new standard for design, but for price too. Tico is only $179. Yup, $179. That's the beauty of unibody design. It's better and it costs less to manufacture. We could set the price higher, but we want everyone to have a Tico. This is where we need your help. We use 3D printing to create Tico. Imagine all the ideas that could become realities. Imagine what you could build. Back us today, and let's find In the last few years, there have been a wave of great low-cost 3D printers that are easy, affordable, and accessible. But they're limited to only being able to print in one color or material. So we questioned and said, how can we take this to the next level? How can we bring 3D printing to a point where we can print objects that are much more representative of the ideas we're trying to communicate? So we created the palette. From elegant home projects to highly complex prototypes complete with electrical connectivity, the palette enables your printer to create objects that used to be in the domain of much more expensive machines. What the palette lets you do is turn your single color 3D printer into a multicolor and multi-property printer. At Mosaic, we've come up with our own unique solution. It takes in four different types of filaments, and it actually joins them together, end to end, into one single filament strand that has perfectly calibrated lengths of each different filament. This approach enables controllable, multicolor functionality from a single extruder, the extruder already on your 3D printer. At first, it was all about color, and that was really exciting to us. But then with this new influx of materials that hit the market, like electrically conductive filament, all of a sudden we're now able to upgrade a printer to print something like a flashlight or embedded circuitry. And that's just now. There are new filaments becoming available all the time, from magnetic to stainless steel infused. And by combining these filaments with the palette, a whole new range of functional parts can be printed. One of the big things we focused on since day one was no modifications as well as cross-platform compatibility. You put the palette next to your printer, run the filament through the measurement system, feed it into your printer, and then hit print. The software that you already use, the CAD programs, they can all export multiple SDLs. You slice these with your favorite slicer, run the output through our app, and you're ready to print. We're going open source firmware and software because although we're covering all of the nice-to-haves and need-to-haves with this product, we know that there's so many exciting applications and things that people have already been telling us about that they want to do, and so by opening up the software and firmware component, they can do it themselves. We've been working on the palette for a year now. We've gone from ideas on a whiteboard to a finalized prototype. We've sourced our suppliers, but now we need the dollars to bring the palette into production. There's no question that Kickstarter is the way. It's a great forum to be able to work with the community and engage and understand and share. By backing this campaign, you're skipping the upgrade cycle of buying a next-gen printer and getting more out of the machine that you have today. You get to make the palette a reality and you get an amazing product before anybody else gets their hands on it. We like having things right away. When you need a cup of coffee, you just push the lever down. Calling a cab is now as easy as tapping for one. And when programming, you can see if your code works at the click of a button. With the Volterra V1, if you need custom circuit boards, just press print.
We've all been there. We send a circuit design off to a factory, wait two weeks for delivery, only to find that there's a mistake. A design takes a couple of iterations to perfect, but who's got the time for version two, three, or four? Just create your layout in whatever program you're already comfortable with. Pass our software the Gerber files, and then press print. We designed this tool to help hardware developers see their ideas come to life faster than ever before. We use conductive and insulating ink to create fully functional two-layer circuit boards without ever having to email files around or wait for the FedEx truck. But this is so much more than just a prototyping tool. It can help you in any stage of development. For small batch runs, the printer is also a standalone solder paste dispenser. Once you add the components, it will reflow the board as well. Go ahead, toss out all those stencils. You won't need them anymore. We've used our backgrounds in nanotechnology and mechatronics engineering to really push the boundaries of this technology. The past two years have been spent in chemical experimentation, making sure we hit our benchmarks for conductivity, solderability, and reliability. Last year, we made the decision to move to Shenzhen, China, the electronics capital of the world. This allowed us to nail down our supply chain and manufacturing processes. Living there was one of the many amazing experiences we've had, bringing this dream to life. We've spent enough time in cluttered workshops, dirty garages, and electronics labs. So we knew that our product needed a small footprint, a durable aluminum body, and a beautiful design. 3D printers and development boards have made prototyping a bit easier. The barriers to hardware are falling all around us, and it's about time the barriers around access to circuit boards fell too. We're only able to launch our product because of Kickstarter and amazing backers like you. We are all part of the now generation. And if we're building the technologies of the future, we need tools that can keep up. This is just the first step for us. There's so much more we want to build and so much more we want to contribute to the hardware community. We hope you take the time to back and share our campaign. We can't wait to see what you create. spend hours modeling your 3D designs and yet many 3D printers leave your prints looking scrappy and unfinished. One of the biggest frustrations is the hours spent cleaning up your 3D prints to create a perfect model. Well, those days are over. Introducing the Retouch 3D. Retouch 3D is the world's first speciality heated tool designed to clean up 3D printed models. Hi, I'm Phil Newman, co-founder of Retouch 3D. Until you own a 3D printer, what you don't realize is that removing supports and getting rid of printing errors really sucks. We figured that if heat created a 3D print, then heat was the best way to clean it up. So, after experimenting with soldering irons, heated wax tools, blow torches, powered grinders and other scary equipment, we arrived at the Retouch 3D. The world's first heated tool for cleaning up 3D prints, with variable heat control and interchangeable heads designed for specific 3D retouching tasks. It's time to finish the job properly. Retouch 3D makes cleaning up 3D prints fun and easy. Simply power on the tool, input your selected temperature level, and in no time, get ready to remove all the unwanted material from your 3D print, like a hot knife through butter. Hi, I'm Joseph Friend, and I'm the product designer of Retouch 3D. When designing Retouch 3D, we knew we wanted to make a product that was easy to handle aesthetically pleasing and something that complemented your 3D workspace. Our final ergonomic handheld design combines comfort and position, allowing users to hold the tool in different hand positions for finishing 3D printed models. With the assistance of heat, our product is truly the first in the 3D printing industry. Retouch 3D's five interchangeable macro and micro remover heads make it easy to remove large support structures as well as close-in supports that are hard to reach. The five Retouch 3D heads have been designed to address the main issues associated with 3D printed models, from support removal to refining layer imperfections. 
My name is Erin Donaldson and I'm an anaplastologist. This means I make prosthetics for people. Well, different kinds of tools and tips are required for different kinds of jobs. Using hot tools gives you more control and it saves you time. Hi, I'm Amanda Hurd, the project manager for Retouch 3D. Let me tell you a little more about our control system. Let's say you wanted to clean up a PLA 3D model. To begin, press the power button. You will know the Retouch 3D is turned on once there is a constant light. Then, select the input from the lookup chart. The Retouch 3D input is a combination of number and level. We have been working really hard to reach where we are today. In the last year, we have developed our concept, formulated our team, outlined our cost of goods, created a manufacturer shortlist, and filed our patent. To make Retouch 3D become a reality, we have mapped out the next 12 months. We will spend the next two months preparing our design for manufacture and starting the microelectronics engineering. Month five, we will see us entering the prototype phase. And in our seventh month, we will expect to begin our beta testing. Subject to beta test results, we expect to finalize the product and bill of materials by month eight. If all goes well, we will start manufacturing in month 11 with first product shipping by month 3D printing is a revolution in creativity. You can make literally anything with it. All you have to do is click print. The pros of 3D printing are flexibility, um, socialization, uh, creativity. So anyone can 3D print now. So there's a bunch of cons. Uh, some of the main ones are cost of filaments, uh, the printing creates a lot of waste product. You know, the notion of filling up a landfill with plastic. Uh, and color. Sometimes we're a little bit color limited. The problem with 3D printing is the filament. It's expensive and it's wasteful. And you're locked in to using only the manufacturer's colors and material. We've got this incredibly promising technology, but it's been held back until now. Introducing Protocycler. The world's first fully integrated, fully automated, safety certified filament recycler. Protocycler allows you to create custom filament in any color you like, anytime, from raw plastic pellets. These pellets are available in a variety of materials and at a drastically lower cost than filament. A one kilo spool of filament costs you up to $50. With Protocycler, you can create that same one kilo spool in any color for as little as $5. That's a 90% cost savings on every spool you print with. Its fully automatic operation, combined with real-time diameter feedback, means that anyone can get perfect filament every time. Because there's a distributed spooling system built right into Protocycler, your filament comes pre-spooled and ready to use. With a class-leading extrusion speed of 10 feet a minute, it only takes about two hours to create each one kilo spool. And given all the expensive waste 3D printing produces, Protocycler delivers a revolutionary solution to that problem as well. Protocycler's integrated grinder can recycle all the plastic waste from your 3D printing. For the first time, any failed prints, obsolete prototypes, and especially rafting and support material can now be recycled into perfectly usable filament in any color. So, using the protocycler to create a one kilo spool from your waste plastic costs you practically nothing. A 90% savings using pellets and a 100% savings using your own waste plastic. Three smart guys in the maker community invented the protocycler solution, the desktop extrusion device that anyone can use. Designers, innovators, students, teachers, companies, makers and manufacturers, anyone, anywhere. When we first started 3D printing two or three years ago, we were blown away by just how easy it was to make pretty much anything we wanted. Uh, but a month later, we'd spent a lot of money on filament and we'd pretty much filled up a garbage bin full of plastic. Looking at this huge pile of extremely expensive waste, we thought, there's got to be a better way to do it. And two or three years later with Protocycler, we have the solution. We realized that in order to make Protocycler perfect, we were going to have to create novel technology from the ground up. When we were using this technology, we were able to achieve extrusion rates of 10 feet per minute and 10 times greater efficiency than leading competitors with spooler, grinder, and full computer control for less than $1,000.
And it's really, a, in my opinion, quite a breakthrough to be able to offer a system that anyone can take out of the box and in minutes be recycling plastic at home. We've managed to create Protocycler largely due to our incredible support network. With years of experience in everything from UL safety certification to shipping logistics and sourcing manufacturers, we have an incredible fulfillment plan that will ensure you get your Protocycler on time no matter where you are in the world. Obviously being able to recycle your materials is wonderful, both on the sustainability side and just on the convenience side. I mean, you don't have to go to the store to buy more material and you save money. So for the first time, the barriers to limitless creation are removed. You don't have to worry about cost, waste, or color preference. Protocycler is the first automated 3D printing recycler that empowers anyone with the freedom to simply create. And that's why we need your help. We want everyone to be able to experience Protocycler. Freedom from cost, freedom from environmental waste, and freedom to make anything you want. So pick up a Protocycler today and empower your creativity.